Hello everyone, this is SOS Ministry, SOS stands for Secret of Secrets. My name is Jason Lee, the title of the message today is The Secret of Holy of Holies. Uh, today we are here in the Ogyanji Lake, it's about 40 minute drive from downtown Tegu and the uh, county uh, director, I mean the governor, uh, made this area for a special uh, lake that people can exercise, go jogging, and there's the beautiful mountains at the background. So scenery is beautiful. Uh, the whole world is filled with the fruit of good and evil. There is no place where there is no laws and regulations uh, when more than two people gather together they begin to make laws and regulations because without them they fight and argue and the society is filled with outlaws eventually the whole society there will be in turmoil uh, so, in the world, there's no place where there is no competition, comparison, and estimation. Laws are good for making orders and serenity of the society, but the fact that there are laws is a tragedy because uh, uh, the fact proves uh, that there is no life. In the world, everybody judges one another and argue over who is right or who is wrong, who is greater or who is smaller. Everybody analyzes, compares and evaluates. How can you stop people doing that? If there is no life, there will always be laws and regulations. In the kingdom of God, the new covenant era was, was declared. In the New Testament, there is only grace and life. Though the new covenant was declared as they couldn't get the enlightenment uh, of the boundary line, they cannot cross the border line from the seventh chapter to the eighth chapter of the book of Romans. Not too many people had received the enlightenment from the Jeremiah chapter 31 verse 33, God's promise about the new covenant. Only those whom the word of God became their body composition, the word became flesh, must be generalized, not to be confined to Jesus only. Many English teachers who cannot speak English, still teach at schools in Korean uh, schools. We received the Japanese-style English education in 1940s. America was the enemy of Japan. Therefore, the Japanese did not teach their people practical English because they were afraid that the American culture might surge into Japan and be swallowed up by it. They simply wanted to copy advanced American technology. That's why they taught English grammar. I simply learned English grammar but not practical English. It was so tough and boring. It was just like walking in the desert. It gave me a massive headache. <clears throat> In the world of estimation of English ability, the Korean English is placed 143 out of 155 countries in the world. This is due to the Japanese-style English education that has damaged the Korean English education. When I entered college, and met an American professor. I was so happy to learn the living English from him. 
I was suffering so much because I was taught dead English. I was freed from the burden of studying English grammar. I'm eternally grateful to my American professor. If a blind man lead a blind man, both will fall into a pit. What a contradiction for English uh, teachers and professors who cannot speak English but teach students English in Korea. Dumb teachers produce dumb students in a massive production factory. Korean English education is a dark reality. <clears throat> Following Jesus is the same. We must meet one true spiritual leader or we will unconsciously follow the blind leaders and surely fall into the ditch. In Korea, most professors uh, have received the Japanese style English education. For the Japanese, America was their enemies in 1930s through 1940s. If they taught practical English, they fear that the American culture would have surged into Japan. So they would not teach practical English but merely wanted to accurately translate American technology materials, hence they taught English grammar. But grammar is so difficult and tough. Since my childhood, it has been a headache to learn English grammar. But when I met the American teacher, I was so surprised. My American teacher asked, why do you study English grammar? I'm an American, but I don't study English grammar. Forget about English grammar. You must study living English. Wow, I felt as free as a bird. The same concept is applied to the reality of the following Jesus. When Jesus said, <clears throat> forget about the laws of Moses, I became a free man. We all became a free people. The whole world is covered with the fruit of good and evil. Our body, they teach about the fruit of good and evil every day. They deliver sermons about the fruit of good and evil as they eat so much of it every day. The whole world is flooded with the fruit of good and evil. If the church is the true church, how can they feed their members with the poisonous fruit, the Satan's life? If the church is the true church, they must supply the organic fruit of life. Jesus himself is the fruit of life. That's why he said, my flesh is the true food and my blood is the true beverage. As we change our food diet, our body composition will also change. We must only eat Jesus himself. We can produce, reproduce Jesus through our own life and our descendants will inherit this glorious kingdom. When Jesus was dying, he said, Father, forgive him. Forgive them, for they do not know what they are doing. Stephen also said, Lord, do not hold this sin against them. This is the world of fruit of life. Apparently, it is impossible in the world of fruit of good and evil. The world of Stephen and the St. Paul is where people all confess, not I, but Christ. The God can dwell together with these kind of people. The Jesus simply summarized his own life and ministry. I came out from the Father and returned to the Father. God created man according to his own image and likeness. In fact, God created man according to the image of his likeness of his own heart and mind. If I praise the Lord for giving us the place the where the light is so bright, where there are bumper crops of the fruit of life all year round, I praise the Lord 
for leading us into the world where people all enter into the Holy of Holies. The Holy of Holies is God's master bedroom and the two stone tablets in the Ark of Covenant is God's heart. Mm. Our hometown <laughs> is God's heart. We came out from God's heart and we are all returned to God's heart. All the creatures came out from God's mind and heart. Therefore, if they cannot return to God's mind and heart, their life is, is failure. But if they can return to God's mind and heart, their life is successful. Their life will not end up in failure. If salmon can return to the hatchery, the life of salmon is successful. Hallelujah. Thank you. God bless you. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you again. <clears throat>